So today I'm talking about a Honda with the P0430 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. So what is a P0430? Well, it's a catalyst system efficiency below threshold bank two. And what does this mean? Well, it basically means Don Moore computer seen a problem with the catalytic converter. They're supposed to be running at uh, over 95% efficiency. And if it drops below that, then it'll throw out this error code and possibly a 420 code can also come up. And the main causes are going to be the catalytic converter or the oxygen sensors. Even though other things could possibly cause this problem since it could clog up the catalytic converter. Things such as uh, right here, such as a gas leak in the exhaust system or a faulty fuel injector. Things like this could clog it up and cause it to have issues. But the usual cause is going to be the catalytic converter or the oxygen sensors. And what does a catalytic converter look like? Well, they're up underneath the car. They'll be bolted into the exhaust system. They'll usually have three bolts on each side that could be that hold it in place. And if one of these do have to be replaced, the main difficulty would be how rusted up they are. If these bolts get really rusted up, they can be kind of difficult to get out. It could be really in there good, but that'll be the main difficulty. If they're not rusted up, they're usually not too terribly difficult. Besides having to jack up the car and get underneath, they're not, they're not located ideally or anything like that. But the oxygen sensors can also cause an issue. And the oxygen sensor is what sends the data back to the onboard computer. So it's reading before, there's, there's an oxygen sensor before called the upstream and an oxygen sensor after the catalytic converter called the downstream. And this is what the onboard computer is using to read the efficiency of the catalytic converter. So if these get off or these go bad, they could throw off the data and cause these error codes. One thing to keep in mind is that the, the wiring that goes to these uh, can also cause an issue if, they, if there's an open or a short or anything like this. If something came up underneath the vehicle and it tapped into the wiring and it knocked it off or something along those lines, then it could cause an issue because bad wiring could cause the same issue as a bad O2 sensor. So something to keep in mind. So what do you do if you have a Honda with the P0430 code? Well, you could go about this several ways. If you took it to a mechanic shop, more than likely they would replace the catalytic converter. And if that didn't work, they would replace the O2 sensors. And that would be pretty common what they would do. Something I've heard about, and I've actually haven't tried myself, is that a lot of people, they'll, they'll get like cleaner, like this Cataclean. I've never used this myself, but uh, I've heard other people use it. And some of them claim they've had pretty good success with it. But basically what they'll do is they'll put this in the fuel. It's a fuel additive. And then they'll take the car out on the freeway and they'll really rev it up. That way it'll blow everything out of the catalytic converter, all the buildup that's got inside of there. Because especially on vehicles, if they're driven slowly everywhere, they're never really taken out on the freeway or the engine revved up high or anything like this. The, the catalytic converter can get buildup inside of there and, and can throw this air code. So a lot of people will buy like like something along this, like Cataclean or something similar. There's other brands, there's other things out there. And basically they'll put this in and then they'll take it out on the freeway for like 15, 20 minutes and really rev it up, try to blow all that out. Then they'll clear the error code and hopefully it stays off. Now, if, you, if this does work, keep in mind that that catalytic converter is getting close to being changed. So even if this does work, you more than likely very soon will need to replace this catalytic converter. Of course, if that doesn't solve the problem, keep in mind it can also be an O2 sensor that's just sending bad data back to the onboard computer. And keep in mind that even if this is swapped out for something new, there could be something wrong with the engine, like a bad fuel injector or something like this that's leaking out fuel and clogging up the catalytic converter. So that's always something to keep in mind that you might replace it for a new one, but the engine is leaking out fuel from a fuel injector and it's coming back and the error code comes back because it's, because the engine's having issues. So that's always something to keep in mind. But that's basically it. I just wanted to give a real brief overview of what you could do if you have a Honda with the P0430 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.